Good morning, everybody. Today is August 15th. Opening bell just happened about three minutes ago, and we are looking for a trade. Looks like uh, it's uh, down today. So we're looking for a trade to the downside. Uh, we'll be watching it closely. Looks like uh, we're getting a signal on the uh, five minute uh, to the upside. I don't have confidence in that signal whatsoever. Um, again, we're just going to be patient and uh, wait to see what it does from here. This is not a good entry for the upside. I forgot to check Forex Factory. Um, I am seeing here that there's lots of news pieces here. Um, the only thing that is a major thing is crude oil inventories coming out at 10.30 Eastern Time. That is... 9 30 excuse me 8 30 my time so we got about 50 minutes or so the markets are probably not going to move very much so that's important to know um here let me let me show you really quick see this is uh this is what i see here forexfactory.com it gives you all the uh, major events um, happening for that day that might affect that, that involved the stock market the uh, New York Stock Exchange and uh, everything in red USD that uh, is crucial um, medium impact orange and uh, low impact yellow so forexfactory.com good place to go uh, for that type of information guys so it looks like we might not be trading um, until after crude oil inventories comes out so stay tuned it's definitely moving lower um, we're not going to get a signal uh, from here uh, because of my indicators we well just continue to be patient here if i do get a signal i think i will trade it um, i'm looking at the uh, 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 We're trading at 281, maybe 282. 282 puts. Um, probably 28150 puts. Yeah, 28150 puts. I'm thinking about getting in here. Alrighty, it looks like I got in at a dollar thirty-six. It got me in really high. <laughs> now it's coming back a little bit. But um, we'll see where it goes from here. I am in at a dollar thirty-six on the two eighty-one fifty puts that expire in two days. Two eighty-one fifty puts that expire in two days. I got in at a dollar thirty-six. I'm down a bit on the uh, trade. It's trading at uh, dollar thirty by dollar thirty-three. Again, I got in at a dollar thirty-six. I already sent my sell order at dollar forty-nine, which is just a tad bit under ten percent. Heading in the right direction at a dollar forty by dollar forty-one. Let's hope it just continues to go lower here quickly. Boy, it doesn't want to just uh, fall apart. Um, 142. The ask is getting up to 142. Uh, it's having a difficult time here. I still have faith in this uh, trade here. Here it goes. Here it goes. And I am out, guys. Awesome. Wow, that was wow. Wow. That was awesome, guys. Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> that was really cool guys that was really cool that was really quick um in and out um sure i was a little worried about it because it had already moved so much moved really really quick wow look at that guys it, it's, it's getting up to 160 wow and i and i saw that at 149 check that out that is so awesome guys that is so awesome and look at that my goodness it's trading at 173 what's the bid and ask 175 by 178 wow 80 180 
I mean, it's just, wow, amazing, 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 amazing. I'm so glad that I decided to get in on that uh, on that trade there. Um, thank you so much for watching, everybody. Hey, everybody, this is Giovanni from Spy Options Trading. What you just saw there is obviously my trading video for, for today. And I apologize in advance. I got to do, I got to make the best of what I got and um, near the road. And so you're going to hear traffic in the background. I think I have chickens and turkeys on this side and dogs on this side. So I apologize in advance for that. Uh, the reason why you didn't uh, see the uh, the uh, signal uh, stick is because um, the the indicator has set parameters, and the uh, those indicators weren't in, within those parameters. But it, obviously, I can pick and choose uh, manually, obviously, um, whether or not to jump in uh, at any point, just like anybody else, of course. Those. Uh, indicators of signals are mostly there for for guides and, and whatnot so uh, thank you so much for watching everybody I greatly appreciate the support um, like and share my videos subscribe to my channel so uh, thank you so much for watching see you next time